hi everyone welcome to my channel i'm shannon i am an attorney i'm a wife i'm a mother so welcome to my channel i'm not even sure what this channel is going to turn out to be but i'm going to be posting content that is lifestyle related i live in kingston jamaica so of course it's going to just be pretty much my life in jamaica it's a work day so i'm on my way to work now i have a meeting i have a consultation with a prospective client i believe it's a property matter and i have that consultation in about half hour um i have a lot of work to do today um my desk i want to also go to fontana to do a return i bought some baskets um for my kitchen cupboard and i want to return them because they don't fit and I don't want to waste my money so. so yeah I'm at work now so I'm going to head in and I am planning on having a really really productive day I'm here waiting for the client to get here I'll just do a quick what I wore today to work so these pants I've I got them like a few years ago from New York and company I love them so much because they're high-waisted I like the color this is like the Bottega Bottega green that you know is that's been popular um, this bodysuit I got from Shein, really, really good quality, like equivalent to the Zara quality, and I bought it for eleven dollars. Really like it. I wear them a lot. I have them in different colors. Really nice because I can wear it under my blazer. Speaking of blazer, um, when I have my meetings, I do put on my blazer. So this is pretty much like the complete look. So yeah so this is what I wore to work today let me see if you can see a full thing and black pumps my favorite I like the fact that it's like um, plain at the front and then you have the at the back it's fun But yeah, that's what I wore today and simple everyday makeup. I need to get my hair done. So don't judge me for that. Planning on getting it done tomorrow, hopefully. I'll get to do that after work. But yeah, so this is what I wore today. So Dwayne, my husband called to say that he got home early so he's able to relieve our nanny so i get to go to fontana yeah so these are the baskets two of them i originally bought them as i said i bought them for the kitchen cupboards but they are too wide i believe so i ordered some on amazon not amazon sorry walmart so i'm waiting for those to come so we'll see hopefully those actually fit because uh, I won't be able to return those. But yeah, I paid, uh, let me see how much I paid. I paid $2,899 for one of these. So I'm, listen, I'm returning them because I don't have anywhere else to use them and I want back my monies. So yeah, so that's the reason why we're going to Fontana and I'm just gonna look around to see if I see anything else. <laughs>
yeah um i need to start working on it so i got that too. and i saw a classmate a former classmate of mine that went to law school with me and she was telling me that she was looking for like this specific deodorant that actually helps and it don't i don't leave any white marks on like when she wear black clothes and so on and she bought it at the barbican fantana and she came to this one and she couldn't find it yeah, yeah, yeah. and she really likes it so she went and she asked um i guess one of the managers or something where it was and she eventually found it so this is it so i told her that i would try it because she was recommending it it's by the brand crystal it says 24 hour mineral deodorant spray and this is in i get the flavor or scent pomegranate it says gentle gentle formulation all day protection easy application no white marks and it can be used for both women and men and the claim is that it's non-sticky non-staining and leaves no white residue so I'm definitely putting it to the test because you know as lawyers we wear a lot of black so sometimes it comes off like on your jacket and stuff like that the, the deodorant mark so i'm curious to try this it's actually a spray deodorant it don't have a strong scent to me you know what it smell like actually it don't smell like anything so that's interesting so yeah, those are the things I got from Fontana. Now it's time for me to eat some dinner, which my nanny cooked. She made curry chicken. I'll show you guys, it looks good. And then put little.
Stephanie is in class. And Manfas, who just did the OOTD. Better lighting. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Alright, so I'm about to head out now to go and get my hair done. So, yeah, I'll check back in after. Hopefully, it looks good. I'm gonna know. Should I really be going back? The short hair, we'll see. shopping so i'll take you guys along for that as well i feel good because uh, yeah i feel like today was a success
lunch now so we're heading back down off the hill the food was really good as usual the red pea soup needed just a little bit of salt but you know it was good I had enough pigtails and uh, there was spinners in it so it, it tastes really good and the barrel chicken which is what all three of us ordered was really good as always and the portion was as you could see on the video the portion was a lot so we have um, leftovers going back with babe how much would you give um, the chicken the food the food overall at eats because Dwayne got French toast, like a side of French toast with a pineapple chutney and that did taste so good. It was really, really good. It was like a meal and then you have that as the dessert portion of it. So how much would you give it? Eight. Eight, eight out of ten? Yeah. So, and that's a high rating for him because not really, he's not easily impressed. Um, so yeah it was good we enjoyed it it was a bit overcast and we had a little drizzle that's strawberry hill up there we had a little drizzle um but we were able to sit outside so it wasn't that bad uh bailey bailey was okay trying to explore everything um but yeah it was a really nice day out amelia what do you think was it fun how about the food it was good so you had a good time all right yeah so we're heading back off the hill now back to